Good morning, I'm here with Jonathan Seidel, and he's a candidate for Lieutenant Governor uh, for Pennsylvania in 2010. Right. Good morning. Good morning, thank you, thank you. I, I'm Jonathan Seidel, I'm running for Lieutenant Governor of our great state. I'm a CPA and an attorney, spent 16 years as the elected controller of Philadelphia. Um, was a dear friend of uh, Catherine Baker Noah, great lady of our great Commonwealth, who God rest her soul passed away was the last lieutenant governor. Right now, uh, the, Demo the Republicans control the lieutenant governor's office. We're going to make sure that doesn't happen next year and elect a, a Democrat for a governor and a Democrat, me, for a lieutenant governor to, to help our state, to be progressive and, and help the people that we care about and make sure that our ideals are part of our government agenda for the next eight years, hopefully. Thank you. You had an impressive record as controller in the city of Philadelphia. Uh, why don't you talk about some of the accomplishments uh, uh, that you did in Philadelphia, which were quite impressive. Thank you. I wrote uh, two books along with my office on how to uh, constrain the size of government, not raise taxes, but reorganize our government so we gave people the deliverable services that they so justly deserve. Uh, we don't have to automatically raise taxes, but we have to be sensitive to the needs of our community and the services that are being provided. And I think we can, I think I can bring that on a statewide basis to make sure that the state works with our county leaders, with our township leaders, with our city leaders, and have a real coordinated effort uh, to bring people the services they need so we can get out of this recession and move forward to progressive times and, and take care of it. I, I miss helping people, which is why I'm running, uh, and I look forward to helping people as Lieutenant Governor of our great state. A lot of what state government does is in tandem with counties, uh, right. and, and of course Philadelphia is a county itself. Uh, a lot of these important social services or, or mandates that are funded by the state government right. and uh, your background is financial right. and uh, so you could how could you uh, facilitate that and, and uh, help that as lieutenant governor is that something you could do oh absolutely I, th I think that my background as a certified public accountant as an attorney about uh, being the controller of Philadelphia for 16 years I taught public finance at the University of Pennsylvania, at Drexel University. That type of background puts a commitment to the people of our great state and the Democratic Party of our great state, I think gives me a unique perspective to understand the relationship between county government, city government, and the state, and to really all of us work together uh, to coordinate, to make sure that we get the best bang for our buck and get the services that our people need. And you're absolutely right. Uh, all this money of the services are so commingled with state government. Uh, that if we work together properly, we can save money and I think be much more efficient for years to come. Where do people get more information about Jonathan Seidel? There's a, a website. I, I don't really know what the website number is, but you can punch up on Google, punch up my name, and it'll give you the website on, the, on my race for lieutenant governor. I've been endorsed by the state teachers. I've been endorsed by the firefighters. I've spoken at the building trades, the pipe trades, and the Teamster Convention already. I was the only one who's listed as a candidate for any office next year. Uh, I'm proud of my record with labor, and I'm proud of my record with people, and I think you can learn much more about me just by Googling my name, and I look forward to, to people interacting with me. Sure, and I'll embed a link straight to your video in the article on Thank the blog. You. Thank you very much. All right, thank you.